Can you tell us what you went through last night? We got lost in the jungle in the dark in the mud without a flashlight. <laughs> um, uh, first, um, somehow, Paco, one of the archaeologists, got lost. He went off on a on the wrong Chiclero trail, um, and then I was following Paulino, who is another archaeologist who knows all about the plants and the birds and the soil, and somehow he also got us lost, and so we were. Uh, lost for about two hours and low on water and uh, it got to the point where he uh, dumped his water bottle in a muddy puddle uh, and put vitamin C in it thinking that we would have to drink that if we got lost and had to wait for a uh, ajero or cowboy to come by and, and rescue us. Um, we arrived at the midway point camp late and, uh, and, uh, and, and still no Paco. So we got into a heated debate about what to do about Paco, whether we were gonna rescue him or just, or just wait around the camp to uh, see if he would show up. I offered to uh, advance to collect our satellite phone and call back to Carmelita, um, but that, was a, uh, that, that wasn't a very popular idea. Um, after uh, Carlos and one of the Chicleros went off on the trail, uh, they came back probably about three hours later uh, with Paco, um, but Carlos was in such bad shape um, because his, his legs were uh, tired because he had been up to about here in mud about to where? Um, that we had to leave him at that at that camp um, with a bunch of the other Chicleros, but at least they'll have food and water. Um, and uh, I think they're gonna send someone back for him this morning. Um, so we uh, went to bed, or we, bed, um, on a tarp um, uh, at about uh, probably nine or 10, woke up at two in the morning and hiked for another two hours. Actually, no. We, it ended up being about three and a half hours uh, because we did it all in the dark. My, uh, my headlamp uh, battery died and so I was pretty much walking blind with a walking stick. Um, and uh, we sung some songs to keep us company. What do we expect to have today? God knows.